so just left the gym and I'm thinking that some people are going to want something a little bit shorter, a little more concise than what I made earlier. So here it is, a quick summation of everything I've been trying to cure tinnitus, uh, just trying stuff out, okay? Um, I have tried not eating, <laughs> fasting for extended periods of time. I've done both a wet and a dry fast. Um, dry fasting, I've only done up to 40 hours and wet fasting, I've only done up to seven days. So, uh, five days is 120 plus another 48 hours. So 168 hours. Um, that helped for volume that lowered the volume of the ringing. It changed the, the pitch a little bit, but, um, it did not end up curing any of the ringing, um, after commencing eating again, and I had some caffeine after I started eating again, the uh, ringing came back to its normal volume, and the swelling in my ears is still less, but it's still there. So, um, fasting was helpful, didn't necessarily cure it, but it taught me a lot about willpower, <laughs> and it, it brought about a lot of other benefits that you can find in some of my other videos and online and trying it out yourself. Um, any kind of ice baths, cold water treatment, freezing, cryotherapy, anything like that uh, has not cured any tinnitus. Uh, it makes me feel great, okay? The physical benefits of such have been through the roof. I highly recommend this to all people. Once a week, go freeze your butt off. Feels great. Did not cure tinnitus. Um, Sauna treatment, really high temperature. So you're sweating. Maybe you can't tell right now, but uh, just got done with some of that. Less effective than the cold water baths as far as tinnitus is concerned. Um, still feels great. Both methods really helping with the willpower. Both really helping with, with physical benefits for myself, but still no cure. Um... Getting plenty of sleep, not a cure. Uh, I've cut out sugar, that helped a lot. Oh my gosh, so cutting out sugar as much as possible. You drink only water, you eat very clean foods, nothing processed, don't eat processed garbage. Uh, that's, that's helped a bunch. Um, as far as the pitch has been lowered, it's less whiny, and the volume has gone down. Um, regular meditation is helpful. So, uh, two different methods. One is just to focus on your breathing. Just become present to the moment. Get mindful of your surroundings. Okay, do this for anywhere between 1 and 20 minutes a day. It'll change your life. Very, very helpful to... Ignore is the wrong word. To deal with any ringing in your ears. Anything that's annoying or bothering or hurting you. Um, another method is actually a visual visualization where I imagine symbols... Uh, you know, the, the drum things you hit, they're metal, they make the kind of a pseudo gong sound sometimes. Um, so a symbol, um, you imagine that on the inside of your head, two of them cupped outwards. So if, if there was a symbol in my head on this side, it's cupped outwards to, um, around my ear from the inside of my skull outwards. Hopefully that makes sense. Uh, so you have these two symbols and they're pressed against your ears from the inside of your skull. Now you imagine them blocking all sound from the outside world and press down on the symbols. Okay. So essentially you're like, it's a compactable symbol that's crushing your ears. Maybe don't think of it that way, but uh, um, imagine that as a sound dampening kind of thought exercise while you're practicing your breathing exercises. And imagine as you do that, the, the ringing and noise from the outside world becomes less. Do this for one to 20 minutes a day. Focus on lowering the volume. Maybe the volume itself is lowering. Maybe your awareness of it is becoming less voluntarily. Either way, that has helped a bunch. So um, I'm trying to think of anything else I've done. Uh, cardio. I mentioned cardio in the other video. Uh, high intensity interval training, um, a steady state cardio has not cured any tinnitus. Still have ringing in the ears, but again, your patience goes through the roof. Your, your good feelings about yourself go up. You feel better physically. You don't notice it as much. So 
I guess at the end of the day, I have yet to discover any kind of cure for tinnitus. By pushing myself to different extremes physically, um, I've found comfort in my own capability. I've found acceptance. Uh, I've grown patience and willpower in a lot of different ways. That has been very helpful. Uh, but the search goes on to try to fix ringing ears. We'll see. Maybe, maybe science and medicine will catch up and do my job for me. But in the meantime, all I can do right now is accept where I'm at, accept what I hear, and do what I can to live my life as fully as possible, regardless. So, best wishes to you. Hopefully some of this was helpful. Maybe you can share some techniques that have worked for you, and we can get a conversation started. Good luck. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. And if I may